Thank you so much to Dossier for sending over their perfumes. So if you don't know about Dossier, Dossier delivers the highest quality, luxury-inspired fragrances at a fair price. The one I'm unboxing right now is Floral Violet. This one is inspired by Marc Jacobs Daisy. So the top notes are watermelon, pomelo, and strawberry. Okay, so now moving on to the next one. Now this one will have to be my favorite. It smells so good. So this one is the Gourmand White Flowers. This one is inspired by Victor and Rolf, the Flower Bomb Perfume. The top notes on this one is bergamot, green tea, freesia, and berries. So if you want to get your hands on one of these perfumes, I highly recommend you to check out their website. I'll have it right here on the screen. Guys, they have tons and tons of inspired perfumes. But this one will have to be my favorite. It smells so good. I am going to be wearing this one today. But make sure to check the description below for the link and also my discount code. And also a huge thank you to Dossier for sending over the perfumes. to a new video hey everyone how you doing hope everyone's doing amazing hope you're having an amazing night amazing day whenever you're watching this okay guys as you can tell by the title i'm going to be shopping at target for makeup items so i really have been wanting to try some new makeup items i've seen so many on tiktok that i am dying to try so if you follow me on instagram i asked y'all what are y'all favorite makeup products at the moment and y'all gave me some really good suggestions i even wrote some down in my notebook so I definitely want to look for these today. I definitely want to look for the e.l.f. powder puff and also the health health. Also the e.l.f. halo glow filter. Those two are like on my list for sure. But yeah, guys, I'm going to show you my outfit and we can be on our way to go. Girl, before I show you my outfit, look at this Hello Kitty mirror that I bought. I bought this at a Tarte, no, TJ Maxx. It is so freaking cute. I put it on my Alex 9 drawers. So if you have me on Instagram, you know I showed you this already. But look, I'm obsessed with it. Like, I was so hesitant if I should get it or not, but I'm so glad that I got it. It was $70. All right, guys, so here's my outfit. I turned on my light because it's kind of dark outside. It's very gloomy today, but I don't know if I want to wear this or not. This I got from Forever 21, and my shorts are from uh, Shein. They make your booty pop. Like, pop, pop. Like, girl, if you want that voluptuous booty, you need to get some biker shorts from Shein. And then I just have my new balances on. All right, guys, we're here. So we are going to go makeup shopping. And usually when we come here, there's no one here. But there's, like, a lot of people here. But let's see. Okay, what I really want to look for is the e.l.f little puff thing Ugh, oh my god it's here guys this is exactly what i want i'm definitely getting this i need to see which one is in my shade but i'm definitely going to get the elf halo glow filter i've heard so many good things about this okay i also want to try these the elf camo powder foundation i'm also going to try this one i don't know what color to get i'm so bad at matching myself maybe i'll probably get this one Okay guys, this is what I have so far. So now I'm looking over here at the NYX. Guys, they have Morphe, but it's all open. Like why? Why do people have to do this? They're all open and messed with. Okay, so the one thing I really want to try from Beauty Bakery is their powder. I don't think they have it here. Their setting powder, I really want to try it. Okay, I really want to try this Maybelline Perfector 4-in-1, but they don't have any in my shades. Like, they're all dark. Um, I used to use this all the time. The concealer, it's really good. And I used to, this was my all-time favorite primer, guys. I used this for years, but I stopped using it. But this is a really good primer. The Maybelline Master Prime. Also, a lot of people said this is a good loose powder that fit me. Um, but I really, really love my She Glam powder, so I'm gonna just use that one. But I do want to try this one in the future. Okay, one of my all time favorite mascaras is the Colossal. Me and my mom love the Colossal mascara. I used to use this all the time in middle school and high school. I will use this one, the purple one. 
Um, but yeah, the Colossal is like one of my mom's favorites. Also, I've used this one too. It's pretty good. Um, yeah, I like this one. Okay, if anyone's tried this, let me know if it's good because I want to try it. It's $15. It's kind of expensive, but y'all let, let me know if y'all like the camo CC cream. Okay, I already have the... Great. I love that. I already have this I like it and I already have the putty blush so I have already tried them I really like them I recommend them if you haven't tried them look how pretty this NYX lip gloss is oh my gosh this is so pretty I love that also the butter glosses are amazing I love the butter glosses Okay, I wonder how these Makeup Revolution concealers are and also the foundations. Y'all let me know if y'all try the foundation. I'm gonna hold off on the foundation, but I think I might grab a concealer because I do want to try one of these concealers. Okay, but doesn't this blush look really pretty in the shade Pink Lady? That's like a really pretty pink color. Should I try it? I think I might try it. Let's have this one. Okay, y'all also told me to like try out the Milani blushes, but I don't know where they're at. Oh, right here. Oh, these Milani blushes. Um, I feel like I used to use this in middle school. Like, I feel like this is like a, I don't know. But I feel like like my grandma uses this blush or something. Um, they have this color. This one's kind of bright. Chef's cheek kiss. Fruit fish, fruit fetish um, lip oil. And they also have this rose balm, transforming lip balm. Hey guys, we're at Wet n Wild, so I saw this primer base. They didn't have the NYX marshmallow one. That's the one I really want to try. Like every time I come here, I see it. And the one day, the one day I come, it's not here. So I'm very sad. Okay, so I have never tried the butter bronzer before. Never. So I think I might get it because I, I really want to try it. I know this is not a hygiene shop with me, but look. They have a Coca Colada whipped body butter. What the heck? Guys, do I need it? Yes, I need it. <laughs> okay, just one, just one. Okay, I found it. I was like, where's the pixie stuff? So I'm looking for that pixie blush stick and obviously it's not here. <laughs> Why? What else do they have? What is this? Pixie sheer cheek gel. Okay, so I'm looking at the NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop Full Coverage Foundation. I think I'm going to go ahead and get one because I do want to try this. But I think... Let me get this one. Okay, look at these NYX Born to Glow Highlighter. This is actually really pretty. How much is this? $11.99? Look how pretty that is. So we have that. Um, what is this? NYX Finishing Powder. The NYX HD Finishing Powder. Translucent. I have these lip glosses. NYX lip glosses. I'm looking at the NYX. Um, okay, I really like these highlighters. They're really pretty. I don't know. I think I'm going to grab a e.l.f. Poreless Face Primer. I think I'm going to grab this one. An e.l.f. Dewy Coconut Mist. I think you're going to have to come home with me, ma'am. Gosh, guys, I found it. I was about to check out and I found the Pixie Blush. On the go, Pixie Blush. Is it the same shade? Yeah, the same shade. Okay, I'm going to try that out. What is this? L'Oreal Skin in Paradise. Oh, a tint moisturizer. Hmm. 
all right guys i think that's going to be it i checked everything i could not find the little elf powder puff whatever it's called i'm so sad because i really really wanted that one Hi guys, I got the makeup. I'm gonna go home and do a haul. Okay, I'm at Walmart to see if they had the powder puff because I really, really want it. And look, they have like the e.l.f. cookies and cream stuff, but uh, I hate that they have everything locked up now because I just like don't even want to bother asking like, hey, can you open it for me? Because I'm just like, eh. And I don't really like talking to people, so it sucks. Like, this is all... Like, girl, like nobody want to go through all this. Just why do y'all keep all this locked up? But anyways guys i'm gonna go ahead and show you the haul but i really want like the cookies and cream primer i really want that but i don't want to ask no one <laughs> is anyone else like that oh well let's just go hey guys so i just came back home so i'm going to give you the haul so my total was i don't even know where the receipt hold on let me get the receipt okay my total was 194 dollars So yeah, makeup is so freaking expensive, but I got some good things, so I'm going to show you. Okay, so the first things I picked up was this e.l.f. Ride or Die Lip Balm. Okay, so this is the e.l.f. Lip Balm, and this is in the shade Jazz Peachy. They did have two other shades. So yeah, I got that lip balm. Okay, next, I was so happy I found this because I could not find the e.l.f powder puff whatever it's called i wanted to so bad i could not find it i went to walgreens and walmart and there was none so i grabbed this elf halo glow liquid filter so i've heard so many good good things about this on youtube on tiktok on instagram so i got mine in the shade light medium okay i also got this elf poreless putty primer so i have been wanting to try this one so um i didn't know if i should get the translucent translucent one or this one but i went with the poreless putty primer this one is the universal sheer so i've heard so many good things about this one too i wanted to try that one so this is like one of my favorite concealers by the way guys my grandma is blasting her movie right now so if you hear that in the background i am so sorry she's like freaking blasting it but anyways i got this in the shade light ivory i freaking love this elf camel concealer the hydrated one is my favorite so this is the one that i really really like i really want this one this is the elf power grip primer i've heard so many good things about this that it's a really good primer so i wanted to get this so yeah i got that one i think this one's ten dollars okay i also picked up the elf poreless face primer too um i used to use this years ago in like the little two but they came out with these big ones so i grabbed the poreless face one okay also picked up this dewy coconut elf mist so y'all know i love my coconut scents anything coconut in it like i'm most likely going to buy it so i just picked up this setting mist okay i wanted to try the physician physicians 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 formula buddy bronzer so this has been talked about so much for like a long time and i'm finally trying it this is a little pricey I okay also picked up this makeup revolution pink blush look how pretty that blush is i just love this color so this one is in the color or shade pink lady so yeah, I just thought that was a really pretty blush. Oh yeah, I also picked up this e.l.f. Camo Powder Foundation. So yeah, this one I got in the shade Light Clear. I'm really bad at like matching myself. I really am. So hopefully these match me pretty good. Uh, let me see what this one looks like. Ooh. <laughs> Open. Hello. Oh, there it goes. I don't know I'm smelling it, but look. Oh my gosh, I'm excited to use this. And it comes with a little pad. Okay, moving on, I picked up the NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop Full Coverage Foundation. Okay, so every time I go to Target, I always pass by this and I never get it because, I don't know, it's kind of pricey. But I got mine in the shade 
I'm not sure. I'm not sure what the shade is, but I think it might be a little bit too dark. We'll see. Um, I also picked up the Wet n Wild Primer Base. So this one is a silicone free primer. So yeah, this one is Wet n Wild. And then I also picked up the NYX Pore Filler Primer Base. So I just picked up these two primers. This one's from Wet n Wild and NYX. So let me know if y'all tried this one, the Pore Filler one. Okay, and then I picked up the Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define. Okay, so this one I hear mixed reviews about. Some people like it, some people hate it. So I am going to try it out. I got mine in the shade C2. I really want like a bright under eye. I have, been, I have been obsessed with like bright concealers recently. I just love that. Last makeup item that I got and I'm so happy I found it. I was going to check out and I found this. So I finally got the Pixi On The Glow Blush. So this has been so trending on TikTok. Mine's in the shade on, no, flop. Wait, what? I don't know how to say that name, but let's see what it looks like. <gasps> look at it i'm so happy at least i got this you know like i really wanted to i don't know why i'm smelling them but look that, so, that looks like a pretty pretty color Ooh. okay yes i'm excited to use this one that's what it looks like okay the last thing i got and it is not beauty or makeup okay i passed by the little hygiene section and i saw this wit shape um body butter the coca colada so coca coca so coca colada is like one of my favorite it's like my top three favorite scents so this is the body butter oh my gosh this smells so good i am so glad i got this so i had to pick this up had to Okay guys, so that's going to be it for this Target Makeup Come Shop With Me. So I barely could film in Target because there was like so many people. When we go when we go out shopping, we never go on the weekends. We always go on the weekdays, so that's why there's never no one there. But this time, everybody and their mama was shopping. So I barely could film, but it's okay. Um, but hopefully y'all still enjoyed it. I am excited. I am most excited for the Pixie Blush um the grit primer and where is the oh and this one these three i'm most excited to try okay guys so i'll see you in my next video say bye with your mouth say bye with your mouth say bye with your mouth Okay, everyone, so that's going to be it for this video. Bye.